So Brindley with his first interception of the night. And about the first time Lebanon's de or offense has been stopped. They have punted once. So Shelbyville with some life for the first down at their own 22. 7-10 to play in the third. Donnie Chun on the option. Don Castleman. Jonathan Haas and Rod Crutchfield. Crutchfield got him low. Haas nailed him up high. The ball at the 21, a one yard loss, second down and 11. Stephen Brinkley goes out wide to the right. Jason Baker to the left. Chun trying to throw. C slips. Throw way down. Complete at the 50. To the Shelbyville 49. Kevin Huddleston with the stop. I think that's Stephen Brinkley. He was lined out wide to the right. And the first down for the Eagles at the Shelbyville 49. McCulloch wide right. Jason Baker comes wide to the left. Don Castleman to the 45 of Lebanon. Rod Crutchfield on the stop for the Blue Devils. <coughs> Second down and four for the Eagles. Five and a half minutes to play in the third quarter. Lebanon leading Shelbyville 20 to nothing, but the Eagles on the move. Don Castleman and Brewster there on the stop for the Devils. <coughs> About a yard pick up to the 44. So third down and three. Jason Baker, wide to the left. Drop football. Chun picks it up. He tried to get it to Castleman. He, that was either a fake or Castleman just didn't grab the ball and it ended up being dropped. But Chun falls on it at the 45. Fourth and four. And I would say Shelbyville will probably go for it. They're about, no, maybe not. So Shelbyville to punt. Lebanon with nobody deep, a high snap. No, it's a fake. And they don't get it. Sonny Warmoth with, no, let's see. Richard Moscardelli with the stop. That was John Newman. The ball was snapped to on the fake. The punter went up high and it faked me out, but it didn't fake Moscardelli. And Newman comes up a couple of yards short, and Lebanon has it first down at the Blue Devil 42. Huddleston wide to the right. Jonathan Haas gets to about the 45. James Smith on the stop for the Eagles. A three-yard pickup, second down and seven. Three and a half minutes to play in the third quarter. Still 20 to nothing, Blue Devils. Clay Bueller wide to the right. <coughs> Rod Crutchfield straight ahead in Shelbyville territory down at the 44. John Newman with the stop. And if it weren't for Newman, Crutchfield would have had another 
very big gainer like he had in the first quarter. The ball at the 44 of Shelbyville, first down, Blue Devils. Marcus Stewart comes in for Cyrus Hancock. Clay Bueller wide to the right. On first and 10, Richard Moscardelli, the tight end to the left side. Stewart in the wing. Jonathan Haas, the tailback, to the outside, gets to the 39. Jason Baker and Blake Simmons there defensively for the Eagles. A five yard pickup. So second and five for the Devils. Inside, two and a half minutes to play in the third period. Lebanon sitting on a 20 to nothing lead. Bueller wide to the left. Now Mark Skeen in it, tight end to the right side. Rod Crutchfield, the fullback, to the 34. Andy Ford on the stop for the Eagles. Bring up third down and one as Lebanon continues to run it straight up the gut of the Shelbyville defense. <laughs> Crutchfield and Haas behind Brindley in the I formation. Cyrus Hancock on the wing. Skeen the tight end. Huddleston the split end. Haas first down straight up the middle. And the ball to the 32. First down Lebanon. Shelbyville not looking like a nine, or I should say an eight and one team tonight. I should say a seven and one team, just eight games played coming into this one. Especially not defensively. <laughs> but Lebanon has had a lot to do with that. That offensive line. Pitch Jonathan Haas. That time the Shelbyville defense gets some good penetration. Jason Baker up from his cornerback spot. And the loss, a one yard loss to the 33. Second down and 11. Huddleston wide to the left. Moscardelli, the tight end to the right side. Wing back trap, Cyrus Hancock spins to the 28. Blake Simmons with the stop for the Eagles. So third down and six from the 28. Six seconds to play. That'll do it for the third quarter. Lebanon won't get the play off. So three quarters in the books. Lebanon still sitting on his halftime lead, although threatening for more. 20 to nothing. Blue Devils after three. Back for the final 12 minutes right after this. Medley substituting in droves. Let's see if he's going to try to punt. Brindley, the punter, stays in. He's back deep, so he'll try to bury them deep. Back deep for the Eagles, Jason Baker and Donnie Chun. Well, Brindley shanked one for about 10 yards in the first half. Couldn't do worse than that. Wouldn't mind one like that. Now it's straight up. It comes down at the 11, and this is a beauty. Stops at the 11. That won't help his average much. But the Eagles backed up to their own 11-yard line, and that's what Mark Medley wanted. So Lebanon's defense pitching a shutout as we start the fourth quarter. Andy Ford wide to the right. Don Castleman behind Donnie Chun. Troy sails to the right. He gets the ball. His right halfback spot, and he has a first down. Gets past Huddleston. One man back, Bueller, who can't or who does get him down. Clay Bueller trips up Troy Sales, and otherwise it's six points. 
I think Jonathan Haas would have probably been the only other Blue Devil with a possible angle, but otherwise Bueller saved six points. As it is, it's a first down at the Eagle 41. So a 30-yard pickup for Troy Sales from his right halfback spot. Now Sales comes in motion from the wingback spot. Fake, Chun. Stewart can't get him, Chun throws. In, no, intercepted by Cyrus Hancock. It was intended for James Smith, was a little bit too high. Looked like he went right through his hands, and Cyrus Hancock picks it off. Third interception of the night for the Blue Devils. Stewart with two. So he congratulates Hancock on getting his first. And Lebanon has it first down at the Eagle 44. Now Lebanon's offense back on the field. Juan H. Jennings injured just before halftime, suffering an injury to his lower leg just above his left ankle. He's okay, not wa walking without much of a limp. But the Devils, I don't know, he wanted to play this half. His replacement, Jonathan Haas, gets stopped up here as the Eagle defenders crowd the line of scrimmage. Still a one-yard pickup for Haas. But while Jennings scored all 20 Blue Devil points in the first half, have to credit that offensive line because all the Blue Devils runners are getting big gains behind that line. Stewart and Bueller in for Huddleston and Hancock. Jennings has spent the second half on the bench. Don't know if Hancock could play it if the Devils really needed him, but with a 20 to nothing lead, the situation isn't really that dire. Jonathan Haas. Close to a first down, tackle made by John Newman. Should be a first.